I can see you. What do you want? Come on, Peter, don't be like that. Just open the door and let me in. Listen, I'm really busy right now. Do you think you could come back some other time? Like a year. No, I, I have something for you. Unless it's a thousand dollars and an apology letter, I'm really not interested. And even then, you could just slip it under the door. No, it's, it's too big and... Seriously, you're gonna make me talk to the door? Just open it. Just a little. Alright. Hang on. What are you doing here? Let me in and I will show you. Are you kidding? You can't come in. You have to stop coming around here. Listen. About the fire. It was an accident, okay? And he should have known better than to sneak up on me. Do you know how difficult it is to explain to the vet? It wasn't my fault. Mr. Bumper hasn't been the same since. He won't even come in the living room. I had to bring him all his meals in his tree. God, he's really milking it, isn't he? He lost over an inch of his tail. Okay. I am sorry that I set fire to your cat, okay? Now can I please come in? No! Oh, please, this is really important. Why? What is it? Please? Uh-uh. Just let me in. Okay, look, I really didn't want to have to do this, but you're not giving me a choice, all right? Be strong, Peter. Be strong. You owe Mr. Bumper, big time. I know. This is for him. Is it? It's a rat. Found him on the subway. Wait. What? Hi, Mr. Bumper. No. Oh, you look so handsome with less tail. Yes, you do. Come meet your new friend. <laughs> okay.